Oh no! What's happened to the fort? Refitting it. <laughs> Is it a full refurb? It's a full refurb. <laughs> Just having a, uh, a tea break. Okay, of course. We've got a little bit of bread for sharing. He stopped for tea break. Tea break. Typical workman. Cup of teas over there. Light snack. And then back to it. And back to it. Well, you can see we've already got half of it down already. Yep. So. That's pretty good. So what was a fort is now a ruin. <laughs> Don't tell English heritage, otherwise we'll come down and uh, list it. Well, I was going to say, was it a listed building? Yeah, thankfully not. Thankfully not. It will be by the time we're finished with it, though. <laughs> It'll be called Fort Alexander. Fort Alexander. Yeah. That's not sheep. You see some sheep. Yeah. yeah, over there. Do you want us to give, a, uh, give you a quick tour? Let's do a tour. Let's do a tour. Is this like one of those tiny home tours? It is. Yeah. Or maybe that that will be once it's... Uh... This, is, this is the before the work's done <laughs> and we will do one after the work's done. I mean, we can pretty much see why you're taking it apart because it's you collapsing. can see oh, there is a real sag. Cow in this really? and that's part of the problem is that that's not structurally sound anymore well all of the support seems to be at the front very little at the back where the weight is yeah the fort itself or the house the shed whatever you want to call it looks pretty good still though doesn't it well what we're going to do is we're just taking the panels apart we'll give them a clean out we'll give them a light sand and we'll repaint it but that can be stored for winter over in the barn and then once we've got this down, we can start and have a look what the supports are like underneath and either refit them or reinforce them. Yeah. So but most of these most of the timber that we're actually stood on is rotten. So that's all we're gonna have to come out. We'll use it somewhere else for uh, our timber edgings or whatever. But um Yeah, that's what we're gonna do anyway. Excellent. Yep, yeah, and that. And oh. this is his swing, which we've taken down for winter. Well, we had some really strong wind uh, a couple of weeks ago. Hmm. Uh, must have been something I ate, I think. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, so it was getting wrapped around basically. Yeah. So we've taken it down. Obviously, this is our little rope ladder, which I used to scamper up here. <laughs> we should video that. That would be interesting. Um, but yeah, so most of this is taken down inside. Biggest problem I've had in that is um, when, I, when I come to take the roof off, it's been full of flies hibernating for the winter. So oh, if nice. you're knocking the uh, roof off, they're all dropping down on your head. So thankfully I've got a hatter. Pleasant? Yeah. Sheeps? Yeah. Just looking at some sheep that are over in the field behind us. Can't see them. No. Oh, yeah, there's one look. Just there. Yeah. 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 The other thing we need to do when we replace these is probably put some chicken mesh down. Yeah, and tack so it down it's because it's slippy. really slippy on here. So mm. even even if he were old enough to actually run round and enjoy this, he'd be falling all over. Yeah. I'm, I'm barely able to stand up. So what's the plan when reconstructing? Well, obviously you... we've got the the mainframe so to speak, the existing structure. Yeah. We're going to reinforce that, reinforce the flooring, put some more beams underneath here to actually take the weight. We'll probably put, we've got a pallet there for him to climb up. So we'll probably formalise that better and actually turn it into a little climbing wall for him to climb up. That so would we've got be something wicked. to scamper on here. Yeah. I'm thinking possibly a rope on this backside for him to climb up. Either that or we put a board all the way down and put a proper climbing wall pegs on. That would be really cool. That would be pretty cool. So yeah. Climb up to the top, not necessarily go over the top, but you could come round the side, potentially. Yeah. We'll redo the rope ladder. So that'll either be just a knotted rope or it'll be another one of these. Mm. I think a knotted rope might be nice. Needs securing to the ground, I think, because it swings about too much when you climb on it. It does. Um, and... 
a slide? We might put a slide. We I mean, that's the other thing that we could put on here. We could put a slide coming yeah. down this side. That would be pretty cool, um, Alexander. And then I think we'll extend the deck out that way by about two metres. Okay, so it, at the minute it's just over a metre, isn't it? Yeah, so we'll extend it at least another metre. Yeah. And then we can have a little seat there for either him or Because it's quite a good view from up here, you can see it. So. Oh, are you coming? Are you coming? So, that's the rough. Excellent. Idea. Yeah. Right, you go down so we will keep you updated as to the progress on the fort, Fort Alexander, yes. and next big project in the garden is to try and get a greenhouse or polygon installed. Which is something we're looking at doing down here where there's an existing small brick area. Which looks like it used to be a greenhouse. Yeah, or possibly the start of one that they've never got round to finishing, but yeah. Excellent. Okay. See you later.